Welcome to our podcast, where we explore fascinating stories and ideas from various fields. In this episode, we explore the Kármán line, where Earth ends and space begins. The mystery behind where the Earth ends and space begins has been an open question for centuries. However, the answer is extremely simple, the Kármán line. The FAI, which keeps records of aeronautics, defines the Kármán line as the boundary between Earth's atmosphere and space. It helps aircraft and spaceships to understand the limits. It is critical these days, due to heightened space activity taking place across the world with Musk's SpaceX and Chinese spacecraft regularly taking trips to space. It is 100 kilometers above Earth's mean sea level. The boundary marks a position where aircraft cannot fly, since being over the Kármán line means a propulsion system is required since the air is too thin at the higher level. There is no national boundary to demarcate the Kármán line which takes the form of international waters. The Kármán line helps scientists to keep spacecraft and satellites floating successfully and aircraft pilots to know the limits of the Earth's atmosphere. The Kármán line is named after Hungarian-American physicist Theodor von Kármán, who attempted to define the boundary between Earth and outer space in 1957. Incredibly, Kármán also worked on hypersonic airflow, supersonic speed, and aerodynamics including innovation in jet aircraft, which has become a big industry in the 21st century. Thanks for tuning into this incredible story. If this episode resonated with you, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for more captivating stories to come. Stay tuned.